<laughs> the road was was a winding road in that uh, I did spend uh, 11 seasons here, but uh, the year and a half in Buffalo and two and a half in uh, in LA, uh, I always I always felt that uh, that I was a Calgary Flame, and when I look back on my career, that's the team that I identify the most with, having spent the most time here. Uh, having uh, a big uh, group of, uh, of family and friends and support network here in Calgary and also uh, with, with the team. He was an alternate captain here for seven years. I mean, and that's one thing about Reggie. He was a true leader, both in the locker room, off. We had lots of fun off the ice, him and Rhett maybe more than anyone else. But, uh, you know, that's, that's what made him special, that he was, it was all about team for Reggie. It wasn't about getting the points. It, wasn't a, it was about winning and being a part of the team and part of the community, as you can see with all the stuff that he's done. Craig and Brad just stand behind Robin for a photo. To lift uh, the Stanley Cup in 2014, what, uh, what made the difference for me was not, was not just that ability to lift it, but to have mom and dad and uh, family and friends there to, to share it with. Because, um, you know, I, I had put in a lot of work, but so had they. They'd, they'd, they'd uh, but they'd, you know, made sacrifices along the way that uh, I didn't always see and didn't always realize until you get to be an older older player and, and person. I tried to, uh, to just play as hard as, as I possibly could uh, every time I was out there. I loved the physical aspect of the, of the game and the competition that way. And uh, that's what I really miss, uh, really miss now. But um, I just know that uh, the way my body is feeling physically, that uh, that I wasn't able to uh, to get back there and train the way I needed to to uh, to to be at that level. So that's when you know it was uh, time to to step away. Mm -hmm.